Okay, uh, Mom and Jackie, since you guys aren't available, I'm just going to record this because uh, Mom was uh, interested in where um, the little house was at the locks. So I put a couple layers in so we can solve that mystery. Um, so here's the 1940 aerials. Um, we're going to zoom into the locks here. And so you can see the old lock system in there. And so I had previously gotten the, the lock uh, site plan. So here's the site plan you can see right on top of that. And so everything lines up. And you can see here where it says new lock. And so it looks like in this picture in the 1940s, they're actually working on the new lock chamber. That's the current one that they use now. And you can see where the old spillway was. That's not the current spillway. Um, but mom, uh, you can also see your little house right here, which we'll get to in a second with the photographs. So I think that's about it on that. Let's get rid of the 1940 aerial that's underneath and go back to today. So now you can see that new lock chamber lining up with the new lock chamber the old lock chamber that's filled in, the dredge pass that's uh, right in between those two walls. And you can see how the new spillway is behind where the old spillway was. And mom's got some cool pictures of that old spillway. I was tempted to try to put those into this too. But mom, now you can see where that house was. It was actually inside the fence um, of the current uh, grounds, pretty close to the locks. So let's spin that around. So now we're looking from the other side. And then, Mom, you had a oblique aerial. This one was kind of cool to line up with the old um, site plan. So you can see everything lines up. That road, I don't quite have lined up back there, but we've got everything else lined up. So there's the old spillways. There's your little office that's labeled right there upside down. You can see the office right there. Um, the barge bypass and the old lock chambers right here. And so there's the, the sidewalk up to your little house. And there's the house in the picture. And you can see these spoil banks actually on the site plan. And that's in that photograph that you have, Mom, um, which I think I have next. So now let's look at your little house. Of course, this isn't georeferenced because it's just a regular picture. But there's that spoil bank. You can see it in the photo. And that's the little house right there, water tower in the background. So, no bleak aerial out. There's your house up on that little high ground. You can see on the site plan how much they took out when they built the new locks. There was quite a bank here and some uh, almost boat slips, I guess, or barge slips, but those are all gone and out in the middle of the canal now. So I think that does it. So I'll send you guys a link to this.